Hey, it's Crafty Kitty, and I know I said in my last video that I was going to show you my Michaels haul in there, but the other video got a little bit too long, so I figured, uh, I don't want to make it extremely long, so I'll do this. This is an, more Halloween clearance that I got from Michaels. I haven't gone back. I'm pretty sure they have the grab boxes, but I just don't feel like going to get any. I have enough Halloween stuff. <gasps> Can you believe I'm saying that? I have enough Halloween stuff. I say that now and tomorrow I'll more likely end up in Michael's looking for the grab boxes. But anyways, I bought um, these little treat bags with the eye on them. And I bought this one with the vintage kittens on it saying trick or treat. I, I just think they're cute. I mean, I wouldn't have spent the amount that they were on, that were they were marked for. So they wanted nine dollars for exactly how many bags? One, two, three, four, five, six, six bags for nine dollars. That's that's like a dollar fifty a bag, is it? Yep, it's a dollar fifty a bag. That's crazy. I wouldn't spend a dollar fifty a bag. I spend dollar fifty for all of them. Now I got these. I got two of them. Now, I think these ones are from last year. I don't think these ones are from the ones that went this year. But then again, what do I know? It could be they look similar to the ones that were there last. Eh. It looks like they... Eh. Well, I can't very well do it, and they don't have any... I don't think that one's open either. Well, let's see. I'm pretty sure you guys probably saw these already. Well, let's see if I can get that to come off. Goodness. Okay, I can't get them off because I don't have any nails, first of all. But this little paper pad has different uh, little skeletons and whatever else in here. And they kind of remind me of tarot cards, to tell you the truth. Um, if I find something that I can open this with afterwards, I'll open it and show you. Uh, let's see what else they have. These little guys. These are... Uh, iron-on transfers. Now I was thinking I could probably put a couple of these on pillows rather than t-shirts or on some corn, what are they called? Flower sack um, towels? Is that what it? Yeah. And make my own tea towels kind of thing. So we'll see what I do with those. Uh, what else did I get? Oh, I got this one. I like this sign. It says, if the witch ain't happy... Ain't nobody happy. <laughs> and that's pretty much a guarantee. <laughs> that if I ain't happy, ain't nobody else going to be happy either. The other thing I got were these two things. Now, I know they're exactly the same. But I love the big, um, they look like bottle caps. And this one is pretty good. It says, a night of magic, mischief and mayhem under the moon, Halloween. So I got two of them, but I'm planning on changing this one up with something else. Um, I'm not quite sure, but I have a lot of scrapbook paper that would probably fit this and look awesome as something else. Because I did buy two of the great... I got... Where did I get it? I got a huge one flat from the fall with the apples, the harvest apples and something else on it. Uh, another one. And... I don't really care. That one actually has a sticker. Like, it's like a sticker that goes here and it's coming off. So, and this is not a sticker. So, we'll see what I can do with this one. So, sorry about my hand. Um, I got some more of the Ravens die cuts. I found... I'm just going to pull this out of here. Now, I really, 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 really... Thought these were awesome so of course I had to take all that were left <laughs> because these will look awesome on embellishments so these were a dollar sixty each not bad so I got one and this is what they look like right they're they're skeleton cameos I got six of them plus I already had some from before in my other haul but then, when I was looking at those ones, I noticed in another end cap, they had more of the Tim Holtz. Um, this was Recollections, but they had Tim Holtz as well. And I found these ones. 
and they're metal and they're they look almost exactly the same as the ones on here <laughs> but these ones are metal and they weigh a ton and uh these would make great charms as well and they were 240 each obviously because they're tim holtz they were a little bit more then of course i got these because i have my eye on you <laughs> i'm not exactly sure what if they're flat backed or what because it's kind of hard to tell they're all kind of piled on one another and i can't believe these were actually nine bucks to begin with i think they ended up being like a dollar eighty not bad and then i found these eyeballs as well like i said all in the eye of the beholder what you find interesting <laughs> i know pretty lame jokes hey can't help it. I bought another one of these stickers uh, books like I showed you before. So it has all the stickers, the words and stuff. And then it has like little cards and whatever else at the back. You know, I'm sure you've all seen these from, well, there we go. That's what they look like. And then I found a few more of these. They're called lenticular stickers. Now I'm kind of hoping that these things are covered up and I can't touch them. I really, really hate the sound, the feeling or the sound it makes when people scratch across lenticular um, items. It like gives me goosebumps. It's worse than people who think that chalkboard, nails on a chalkboard are bad. This is, this is my nails on a chalkboard. So it has like the little pictures. It's like it has the ones that change into scary people from normal people. And then... I also found these ones, which were ephemera cards, and they're from Recollections. Now I can open them to see what they look like, because I own them, so I'm allowed to. <laughs> so let's see if I can get this off in the corner so I can show you. Goodness gracious. Okay, there we go. Get that all off. And these ones do look like tarot cards, but they call them ephemeras. So, this is the Emperor, and it's the back, it's just an eye, the all-seeing eye. Yeah, these are kind of, these are tarot cards, goodness gracious. The Lover, the Chariot, Strength, the Line, the Hermit, yeah, Wheel of Fortune, of course, Death. Now, I don't know if most people know, but if you get the death card in somebody reading your fortune, it does not mean you are going to die. It just means there's going to be something reborn in your life or something new. Come, the death of something that, you know, holds you back. Maybe, um, maybe in, you know, you're in a relationship and it's, it's not going anywhere. Well, that could be what that card means, just so you know. It just means there's something better on the horizon for you. I did get another one of these. And I got this one. This Tim Holt one. With the funny little character. I like the witch's hat. Here. And it does have an embossing folder. This was five bucks. The other ones are three dollars. Then I found this one. Uh, it has a stencil and it has stamps. So trying to it's a witch she's flying this way with the and there's a these were only three dollars and eighty cents i don't know why they were three i bought two trying to figure out what i want to do with them because my sister said she wasn't very interested now i did buy another one of these and it's a good thing that i might do a giveaway for this but we shall see because i don't know if that's what i'm gonna actually do but so that was my second uh michael's clearance haul that's everything i got i hope you really really like it i do and like i said if i do plan if i do end up going to michael's to get one of the grab boxes i will definitely show you what i get and we can all enjoy and have fun at the same time for that I didn't even realize at one point that they did fall boxes. Apparently, I missed these. So, oh well. 
if it was meant to be, I would have gone and I would have known that they were there. But I didn't. So no worries and no biggies. We can all just try and do whatever we have to do. So thank you all very much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this video. And if you did, please give me a thumbs up. If you're not subscribed to my channel, please hit the subscribe button and don't forget to ring the bell so you know when I upload new videos. Thank you all for watching. I wish you a happy day and let's all get crafty. Bye-bye.